Hey, good morning. Greg Buckley here at Buckley's Auto Care. We're uh, looking over top of a 2011 GMC Acadia. And we're going to replace the battery in this unit here, or at least kind of give you an indication of where the battery is and what we kind of need to do to get it to be replaced. All right, so you'll notice up in the engine compartment, there's no area for a battery. There's your jumper areas, which is your positive here and your negative here. All right, that's for easy jump starting in case of emergency situations, whatever the case might be. But as you can see, there's no battery at here. So in the back, we'll just walk out back here. We'll show you exactly where the battery is located. And it's located under the seat, under the tray, under the floor mat. You disconnect the take floor mat out right from here. Little tray with a little bolt, looks like this. Remove that and it exposes the battery. Now, before you do anything, before we would do anything, we want to add a battery saver to this, right? We want to plug it in so we don't lose any of our PCM's memory. You know, uh, we don't want it to go out. We don't want it to go dark. We want to keep everything fresh, including radio presets, idle strategy, and whatnot. So on top of the seat down below, you can see a little battery pack connected to the DLC. And that's how we go ahead and uh, save memory. It's very important that you want to do that. So again, it's in the back seat of this Acadia. We'll try and get a highlight back here. Walk around inside. And there's our battery. Remove it as needed. Very simple. There's three bolts and a couple connectors. You get down there and uh, but still not your average battery replacement. You don't want to do it if you're not really a professional and, and you're a, a you know, a DIY doing something for the first time. That's all I'm saying. Greg Buckley, Buckley's Auto Care. Thanks again for watching. We appreciate it. Take care. We'll see you soon.